Hello, it's Clinton Gray. And as you saw on the thumbnail today, we're going to be discussing setting up a route or creating a route in View Ranger, and we're going to do that online. So the first thing you're going to do, obviously, you're going to go onto your View Ranger, you're going to log in, and then you're going to go to Routes and Tracks, Create Route from Scratch. Obviously, you've got some other options here to create a route from GPX, create a route from the View Ranger track, but we're going to start from scratch. So you click on that and you're going to have a page come up, as you can see here. What I'd like you to do is have a look on the right hand side. You have an option for a whole list of maps, including free maps, and we're going to work on Google Satellite. All right, the next you've also got options to generate the route automatically on foot, bicycle or car. And in, if you're in an area where the roads, etc., are recognized and you then welcome to use the auto route generation either depending on what you want, but we're going to stick to generation off. All right. And what you're going to do is you're going to click on a point and that is your start point. Now, if you click on the little bubble above that, you have the option to edit and you can enter anything you like about that. So we're going to just call that start and save. All right. And what you're going to do now, you've got a couple of options, little uh, tips to help you in order to zoom in on the map. You use your little mouse scroll wheel in and out. Okay, that's going to help you. If you want to move the map from left to right or up and down, left click and hold and you can move the map wherever you want to. So let's start. Okay, so all you're going to do is left click along the intended route like that. Uh, a tip for you, if you, you can then move these little intermediates or any point, you can actually click and hold on it with your left mouse button and bring it onto the intended route. All right, so let's just zoom out a little bit. And for the purposes of this tutorial, we're going to move along this, this path and we're going to come down onto this dam. All right, I'm not going to waste your time. So we're going to shoot along here. And then in order to show the benefits or, or some of the other features, we're going to run along this crest, press and hold the left mouse wheel, uh, mouse button, and uh, let's just close that down and come out onto this track. All right, and and that's basically it. You carry on as as we've been sort of discussing and describing. If you look across the top here, you've got some options. You've got route information, which basically gives you a whole lot of of details that you can you can uh, allocate to this route. You've got save preview the route, you can reverse the route, different directions, you can have a look at the graph, which gives you from start to finish, any changes of altitude over distance, and uh, you can undo, so if, if your point is not where you want it, you can then click on the undo button, and that obviously deletes the last point. And then on your right hand side, gives you the actual track details. All right. So let's go ahead and save that. All right, perfect. So let's go back to home. And if we go down, there it is there. 1232. Right, so you can click on it now. And again, there is our little route and any details you want are there. So we click on menu. What we're going to do is export to GPX. It then downloads and it's visible in your downloads. So if we go out of here and we go to here, we go to downloads. There it is there, root GPX. So what we're then going to go is to your phone which you've connected to the phone. And all you're going to do is move that route into your downloads. 
Okay, so that's done. So what I've done is I've got my phone here. Let's get it out. Unlock it. All right. And this is basically I've opened View Ranger in my phone. You can come across here and you can go to Roots. Then you can import and export. So we're going to import externally and we're going to there's the gpx route that we want contains a file click yes close it and if we now go to roots you can see there is the the route that we imported cool and then from there you can take your take your phone out to wherever you're going to walk or or run or ride and basically start the route and that's it very simple and uh, i hope you've enjoyed the tutorial if you like what you see and you'd like to subscribe or if you've got any comments and you'd like to any questions answered you know i'll be more than happy to do that so guys enjoy view ranger it's hell of a powerful it's also really good value for money and uh, we'll see you in the next one cheers for now